Have you ever walked across a bridge in fear that it would fall beneath your feet? Unfortunately, many people's fears became a reality on the campus of Florida International University. On Thursday, a pedestrian bridge fell, causing many deaths. Police officers searched for hurt people who were trapped under the rubble of the collapse. The search and rescue lasted until Friday morning, but sadly, officials believe that anyone who is still beneath the debris has passed away. This caused the search and rescue to transition into a search and recover. As of now, six people were killed, with more supposedly to be found. The recovery workers are now doing the tedious task of searching through rubble to find more victims' bodies and any signs of construction error. The bridge was installed last Saturday due to an incident where a student was hit by a car and killed last year. This bridge was supposed to withstand a Category 5 hurricane, but it couldn't even withstand itself. This wasn't just a freak accident either. The bridge was built by two companies who are notorious for safety concerns. The governor of Florida, Rick Scott, says if anyone's done anything wrong, we'll hold them accountable. This bridge was 950 tons. Imagine getting hit by that much weight while walking to class on a regular Thursday. A voicemail that was sent two days before the incident said that there were some signs of cracks but no safety concerns. Unfortunately, this voicemail wasn't heard until too late. I'm Tegan Kazmarzik. Thank you for watching Cardinal News Channel.